Good day guys! Welcome to another session of General Matics. Today we will be discussing logarithmic functions, equations, and inequalities. For your lesson objectives, after going through this lesson, you are expected to distinguish logarithmic function, logarithmic equation, and logarithmic inequality. Let us start today's session with a prayer. Now everyone, let's bow down our heads and feel the presence of our Lord. Almighty Father, we thank you for the blessings that you continue to give us. May you guide us throughout the entire session so that the lessons that will be discussed to us will help us improve oneself and therefore take us one step closer to achieving our dreams. This we pray in the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. So, review natin yung nakara nating lesson. What is a logarithm? Logarithm is the inverse of exponentiation. What is a common logarithm? Common logarithms or common logarithm is a logarithm with base 10. What is a natural logarithm? Natural logarithm is a logarithm with base e. So, straight na tayo. Punta na agad tayo sa lesson. Logarithmic equation, an equation involving logarithms. So, anything na involving logarithms, basta makita nyo yung uh, symbol na logarithm, automatic logarithmic equation yan. And also, take note na, kailangan, wala siyang, uh, kailangan, equal sign siya rito. Okay? Uh, previously, uh, natakal na natin to rational equations, uh, rational equations and inequalities, uh, exponential equations and inequalities. So, parang ganun lang din. Uh, and, uh, almost similar sila. Ang uh, pinagkaiba lang dito, logarithmic yung process. Okay? Uh, dito naman, sa logarithmic inequality, logarithms involving inequality. So, again, ang check lang natin dito, kung logarithm ba yung process at yung symbol at yung inequality sign. Okay? Again, logarithm equation, single logarithm, or uh, parehas na logarithm, pwede naman, o both sides, basta equal dito. Okay? Next, dito naman, sa inequality, pwede single, uh, isang side ng equation is logarithm, pwede dalawa sides, logarithm, basta te-check nyo yung inequality sign. Okay? Next, logarithmic function. Function in the form of f of x equals to logarithm of x base b. Where the base should be, again, ang base natin dito, ito ang pinakamalaga tatandaan nyo. Ang base natin ay greater than 0 and not equal to 1. Ang pa, uh, kapag function na pinag-uusapan, uh, it should be written in either f of x or any variable of x or equal to y is equal to logarithm any logarithm of any number so kuha nyo ba ayan tatlo lang yan Alam, ano lang ito yung pinakamadaling lesson kasi ang halos tatandaan nyo lang is uh, before na establish na yung ano yung before yung knowledge nyo regarding this sa rational pa lang at sa exponential so pagdating dito very easy na okay so sige diretso yun tayo get ready for the next for the battle, next battle. battle. Okay, let us practice. Identify whether the following is a logarithmic equation, inequality, function, or none of these. So, apat lang to. So, identify lang natin kung uh, equation ba siya, inequality, function, or none of the following. So, mentally nyo na lang. I trust you guys. Sige, mentally na lang. Diretsuhin na kagad natin. Okay? Sige. So, letter A. Logarithm of x base negative 2 is equal to 4. This is an example of? Of course, none of these. Why? Kasi yung base natin ay negative. Okay, good. Kuha? Ayan, very good. Next. Y is equal to logarithm of x. This is an example of? None of these? Hindi. This is an, exa this is an example of? Logarithmic function. Bakit? Kasi e, walang base. Kapag walang base, again... It, it, it simply states that this is a common logarithm. Okay, very good. Next, logarithm of 6 less than a. 
less than. So, meaning to say, ito ay isang inequality. Very good. Next, logarithm of 64 over 27 base 3 over 4 is equal to x. It involves a single variable and also equal sign. So, this is a logarithmic equation. Kuha ba? Okay, good. And that concludes our session. Thank you very much for watching my video. I hope you learned something new today. Please subscribe to my channel and click the bell button for notifications. Should you have any questions or clarifications, you can send me a message through Messenger or an email through my Gmail account. And again, this is Sir Glenn saying, remember, trust the process. Bye guys, see you soon. If you live for something, something you